Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 47, and this is war number three. And looks like we're going up against an alliance called Wild Hunters It, or IT. Hmm, okay. And I looked at a message, and it looks like our leader is saying that we're going to try to go for the win on this one. I'm still waiting for our nice, relaxed war season that... I was promised. But anyway, uh, let me see. Who did they ban? Oh, see, why y'all got to ban my scorpion? Punks. All right. We're going to find out why they did that. All right. Let's um, see what they got going on over here. All right. Okay. So um, both of these look like hulkling fights they can also be guardian i mean not guardian sorry um gallon let's see what we got up here okay that's magneto hmm That could be interesting. I don't know. So Magneto, I think Hulkling can do all the other fights. But if I bring Gallon, he should be able to do those fights easily. So Gallon, Magneto, Hulkling. Yeah. Hmm. I'm looking for a way that I might be able to bring in um, Onslaught, but nah. Mm. Oh, did I see Silk two places? I sure did. Okay. All right. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Uh, Magneto for sure. Hulkling. And uh, Gallon. Gallon should be the safe bet for uh, this, these two fights. Magneto for this fight. And then um, Hulkling should be able to handle this fight. And then we'll see who they want me to, to do if I have uh, somebody that can do one of these fights here. All right, let's get on with the fighting. All right, so I'm going in with Hulkling, Gallon, and Magneto. I'm not anticipating any problems on my path. And I found that I was not assigned to any of the minis this time. Sometimes I get assigned to one, sometimes I get assigned to two, sometimes I don't get assigned at all, depending on what counters I have. And I didn't really see anyone that I wanted to take on with the champs I brought. Might be able to do it, but I'm pretty sure there were other better counters, all right? So just gonna boost up a little bit here. I don't really anticipate any major issues uh, against this infamous Iron Man. Uh, especially with uh, Gallon, and on this node, I should ramp up very quickly because of the armor up that uh, Infamous Iron Man has. And just look at that. Look at the planetary mass going up like crazy. It don't go up like that normally. And I'm maxed out. So now I just need to bait that out because I don't trust the AI. And then I just need to be able to land a heavy. That was supposed to be a heavy. It didn't. So I got that one. And now, should be over with. Boom. Done. So even with the shenanigans, uh, if you've watched me use Gallon, I've had problems in the past with his heavy. I don't know why. But sometimes the heavy just won't go. Sometimes it'll do something else. I'm not sure what's going on. 
Um, but as you saw there, even with that, you know, not doing a heavy, but attacking instead, we still got it. Okay. Now this one, I wasn't sure if his passive armors were going to count and looks like they do. Okay. So I was like, all right, but then you have to worry, watch for the, um, four because then he's going to auto block. You don't want that. Okay. So even though I do ramp up, you do not want to just go ham on him. Not like the infamous Iron Man fight where I could do that. All right. And I'm, I, my health is going down, but you know, I expect it. All right. Now I have 560 planetary mass and I'm like, let me see if that's enough. Is it enough? Not quite, but he got done with the incinerate at the end. So yeah, it was enough. It wasn't enough to get like the, you know, nuke one shot nuke, but the dot afterwards was able to take him out. So that worked. Now, that was uh, what I brought Gallon for. So he's going to rest, a well-deserved rest. And if you've watched me fight um, in Alliance War, you know that anytime I see this Ant-Man, I now bring Magneto. Perfect counter for uh, Ant-Man, future Ant-Man, on this node. All right. So in the beginning, we're going to wait out a little bit, make sure the magnetism gets on there. There it is. He's magnetized. Wait out. Let that armor up go away. And now it's parry heavy and watch for the armor up. It shouldn't come up, but there is a chance that it does. Okay. Um, if you have a three out of three pacify, you're probably never going to see it. Uh, I do not. I have no points in Pacify. And so I have to watch to make sure, you know, if it does come up, wait it out. Wait till it goes away and then go back to it. Okay, so just parry heavy. And sometimes it's really annoying. He has this, um, the power sting. See that? It power drained me. And I'm like, come on. I'm trying to get to my special three. You're magnetized. Quit doing that, you know? But it is what it is. He's going to go down anyway. And I did take my Magneto to SIG 200. So I'm doing extra damage on my heavy attacks. And as you can see, we're now getting there. He ain't going to be able to stop me now. Now, just push it up. Hit him up. Fight's over with. He can't glance this. He can't do nothing but sit there and take it. Mm, love it. Go ahead. I I thought about taking my Magneto to rank five, but he does an awesome job here. Unless some content comes out and he's the perfect counter and needs to be rank five, I'm not going to do it. All right, so this is going to be the last fight. And... It's really the only fight I was a little concerned with. I plan to use Hulkling for this fight. And I was not sure how well Hulkling would do. You know, I knew that um, Terax did not get uh, armor ups. Okay, so I shouldn't have to worry about anything. But Hulkling is immune to shock anyway, so it wouldn't have mattered. So here is basically Terax, bait it out, bait it out, wait it out. There we go. And then go in. And that's pretty much what I, I try to do. Uh, do not let him get you, um, if you can, uh, don't, don't get hit with his heavy attack. When he has that rock field up, don't get hit with that. That heavy attack is devastating. It, it hurts. All right, so here, look at this. I'm trying to get him to block. Look at that. He won't block now. Look at this. He just stood there. And I just got tired of it. And I was like, oh, yeah, now you block when I'm at my special three. So I'm like, all right, you know what? Whatever. Let's bait this out. 
And uh, I think, did I bait it out? Yeah. Yeah, Wait, waited it out, waited it out. There we go. And then I was just like, let's just go. Very annoying, very annoying uh, when the AI does that. Because all I wanted to do, the fight would have been over. So in a way, I guess it's smart. But suddenly he just wouldn't block. Y'all saw it, right? He would attack or he would just stand there. But I couldn't block to get my unblockable fire my special uh, two off. But we got him down. That's all that matters. We got him down without too much difficulty. Fight, fight took a little bit longer than it should, but whatever. Uh, anyway, after a brief intermission, we'll be back and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, we won this war. All right. So we we're on a little bit of a winning streak. All right. You can see the scores here. Shout out to our MVPs over there. All right. So that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day. Thank you.